After Manchester United twice failed to hang on to a two-goal lead in their three, three draw with Galatasaray in Istanbul, Paul Scholes was unhappy by their lack of discipline. Alejandro Garnacho and Bruno Fernandes gave the Red Devils a two. Zero lead in under 18 minutes, but Hakim Ziyech gave Galatasaray a chance to tie the score just before half-time. After the break, Scott McTominay gave United a two-goal advantage once more. But in a frantic match, ZX scored again, and Kerem Akturkoglu gave the home team a point. Scholes criticised United's tactics when they had the game under control because he found their game management confusing. I don't think I've ever seen a game like that. It was absolute chaos from beginning to end. After they went up 2-0 thanks to a masterful start, Scholes evaluated United's play and told TNT Sports, there's a lack of discipline. That's a really tough way to win games in Europe when travelling. They continued to aim for the throat and attempt to score goals. They gave up a goal, a poor goal. It's clear that the keeper had a really difficult evening. However, in Europe... That's simply not how games are won. I have never witnessed a European squad travel far from home, hurl everything at opponents, and come out on top. You are ahead 2, 0 and 3, 1. Take advantage of your positions. Just unwind. McTominay is destroying everything. I think it wasn't disciplined enough to win a game in Europe, but you have to give him credit for the goal and somewhat credit the squad for wanting to score goals all the time. Scholes also questioned United's lack of leadership at the back, arguing that players like Victor Lindelof and Harry Maguire ought to have been urging one another to calm the game down. In agreement with Scholes, Owen Hargreaves noted that United's struggles are ongoing. Given that they have only gained one point from their away games in Europe this season, despite scoring three goals in each of those games. They had command over the game. He said, They scored three here and drew, they scored three in Munich and lost, and they scored three in Copenhagen and lost. They are scoring goals, but they are also giving up easy goals. That is not possible in Europe. TNT Sports met with McTominay after the game, and while he was obviously frustrated with the outcome, he assured that the club would stick together. However, Scholes does not believe that his old team is playing as a cohesive one and claimed that United is not playing as a unit at the moment. To me, it doesn't feel like a team. He said, they don't play like a team. They're not trying to stop it, and nothing is changing. Your two centre defenders in particular need to be bigger and stronger than the opponents they face when playing that way, and I don't think they are. As United prepares to play Bayern Munich at home in their final group match, their future is now beyond their control. To have any hope of advancing to the next round, they need to defeat the German champs, which Scholes doubts they can accomplish. Scholes answered when asked if he thought United could defeat Bayern. At this point, no. The fact that Bayern Munich is eliminated is the one thing that could be of use to them. Even though they fielded a weaker squad, their weaker squad is still quite strong. Hargreaves thinks United have a hard battle ahead of them as well. With the calibre of goals they're giving up, they won't be able to advance to the next round, he declared.